Hi Capricorn, it's L here to do your mid-May 2018 general reading. So whatever comes up is what comes out. Um, thank you to those who have liked, shared, commented, subscribed to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, I do shuffle the cards off camera and pray over them. So we'll give the cards a quick shuffle and we'll get started. Uh, let's see what's going on with Capricorn. Um, some ending, some divorce, some moving out. Somebody's moving in. Uh, some people are thinking about retirement or saving money or their savings. All right. Okay, let's go. All right, so the first card is you right where you are. Okay. The second card is, are you on your correct path? Let's see. Is Capricorn on their correct path? What is the main obstacle for you? What is helping you? How can progress be made here? bottom of the deck knight of pentacles nice so there's an offer coming in or you're extending an offer it's gonna be slow i don't know if it's gonna come it's not gonna come when you want it but it will be on time okay all right let's pull some clarifying cards clarifying card for capricorn right where they are clarifying card for Capricorn be on the correct path. What's the main obstacle for Capricorn? All right. This deck does have reversals, so please keep that in mind. And what is helping you? And how can progress be made here? All right, bottom of the deck. Okay, the two of swords in reverse. So some of you know that you need to make a decision of, about something. It could be in regards to a Libra or a Libra is significant in your life. Um, or an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You are not making the decision. You know you need to, but you, you're not. It's just not happening. Let's get three cards of advice. Three cards of advice for Capricorn. Mm, all, right. all right okay you right where you are the death card some of you are dealing with scorpio or going through a major transformation okay so this month is the fifth month of the year fives are about change so a lot of us including me were instituting the change that should have already probably should have already taken place or you know this is the month where we really feel like we need to enact the change in our life and our career and our romantic relationships and our family whatever whatever changes um are you on your correct path it looks like you will be with the world here there's an ending here two ending cards the death and the world it's a it's a beautiful beautiful combination endings and beginnings You've learned the lesson. You've gone as far as you can go. It's now time to be like the fool. If the fool comes next, I'll say, oh my gosh, Capricorn, this is really good for you. Um, you you're changing the person who you used to be. For some of you. Some of you, it's an ending of a particular relationship, whether it's romantic, business, family situation but you're changing the person you used to be you've gone as far as you can go in that cycle it's now time to step up and level up here i'm here what's the main obstacle the seven of swords um you needing to devise a plan of action and you're doing it in secret i don't feel like this is a whole lot of uh uh deception it could be for some of you dealing with air signs gemini libra aquarius particularly a male air sign may be coming in uh, deceptive but a lot of you just need to devise a plan of action around what is the next 
course for you what what does it look like who are you taking with you um, write out the plan and make write the vision make it um, make it plain you know um, what is helping you the two of wands nice yeah if this is not a plan some of you are moving to you got a plan where you're moving to how you're moving um yeah map it out literally and figuratively put it on paper you know we write it out with spelling you know spell um write it out it can happen. It's supposed to happen. We have two major arcanas opening up the reading. How can progress be made? Seven of cups. To me, this says make a choice. You have choices. Make a choice. Make a clear and conscious des decision based in um, reality and rationality um, and logic. That's not hard for a Capricorn. Um choose wisely don't be easily swayed by what is shiny and, and Capricorns are pretty much aren't but w what this says is don't let someone else disillusion disillusion you or create disillusionment around you or you know do a song and dance for you and, and then you go that way whatever way that may be don't let that happen because an offer is here with the Knight of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, the solid offer. Or you're, I feel like this is you offering something else to someone else. Or something else, some entity. What's clarifying? Death is the fool. Wow. Death, the world, the fool. Oh my God, this is such a new beginning. Take the risk. Take the, take the leap of faith. Do not be confused emotionally about it it looks good it is good probably I don't know get a personal reading uh, are you on the correct path we got the world here and the seven of swords in reverse nice some secrets and some lies some deception will be revealed to you and, and that's why this ending is happening uh, this was said when I mentioned some of you dealing with deceptive maybe air signs a male in particular it's going to be revealed to you. Um, they think they're getting away with something. No. It's going to be revealed. Um, what's your main obstacle? That seven of swords. Upright. Temperance. It could be a Sagittarius. Um, or what this says is. You devising a plan of action to move in a different direction. Either a physical move, mental move, emotional move away from. Um, will bring you balance. Spirit is also working with you to push you forward in something or with something and to bring back that balance. Um, you were off kilter in doing something or way of life you were living. Now it's time to get back in balance. All right. And what is helping you? We've got the two of wands and then the three of swords. Yeah, you're going to have to, like I said, some of you going through separation, divorce, um, maybe due to infidelity. Um, you need to practice caution in a particular relationship. It might be third party. All of those things. Um, how can progress be made? By making a choice with the Seven of Cups here. Four of Wands in reverse. Yeah. Um, make make a choice. Make a solid and sober choice. Because your, your stability is at hand here. The Four of Wands is in reverse. Seeing that. Stability is already a little bit upside down in the regards to, I want to say, a relationship. A particular, maybe even romantic relationship. Uh, so you need to make a, a, a conscious decision. Are you going to stay or are you going to go? Are you moving away from or are you going to make new? So you can turn the four of wands upright. what's the advice for you guys you are stronger than you know some of you feel so weak in this situation because you've dealt with it for so long get some rest some of you are not sleeping not resting well anyhow gracefully aging these two cards fell out of the deck 
off camera for you. So when I get these two in combination, this says to me that maybe someone in your midst is or was dealing with someone younger than you. You know, you were in a relationship or in a business partnership where someone went another way because the energy was youthful. That could be romantic, that could be business, it could be career, whatever. And this has you questioning your self-worth by way of your age. Now, you can be whatever age. It's all about how you feel inside, how you take care of yourself, how you look, and your confidence. And confidence comes from, firstly, inside. Gracefully Aging also talks about... Um, really getting honest with yourself and saying you know do i need a makeover um do i need to invest in me do i need to invest in some self-care do i need to enact a beauty regimen um age is not quote unquote on my side anymore so maybe i need to take more particular uh measures and time with myself it's nothing wrong with being honest about that. And, and Capricorns, y'all, I could talk to y'all like that because, you know, y'all got, you know, I'm an Aquarius. I, I, I'm an Aquarius with Aries rising. I pretty much most of the times just say anything, which is not always good. But I, I, over the years, I filter it. Forgiveness at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, some of you need to forgive a certain situation like I said some of you are in third party situations when I see that gracefully aging it might have even been with a younger counterpart for your for your spouse or boyfriend or whatever they may have been to you um, or if it was in business someone went in a more youthful way of doing things and you felt you know it it, 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 it shook you but what this says is have a new start. And in it, having that new start, being like the fool, take care of yourself and put yourself first. Know that you are worth it. Um, you may not be 20-something or even 30-something, but you are worth it, whatever it is. And you're stronger than you know. You can get through this. You can get through the divorce, the separation. All right, so Capricorn, if this reading resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Also... Some of you still dealing with um, departure from a job, a career. You were in that career for a long period of time. You say you dealt with it, but you really haven't. You felt as if that that shift, that change, um, however you left the company or was asked to leave the company or whatever, you felt like it was unfair and unjust. Something inside of me is telling you to tell you is telling me to tell you that the uh, the unfairness and the, the 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 unjust actions and measures measures that were taken uh, against you or surrounding you, you will find um, clarity, and you will get justice in the end for that. That your servitude didn't go in vain. All right. Okay, this is for you. <laughs> That's for somebody I don't know. This is sometimes these messages they just anyway. If this resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, take advantage of the fifteen dollar reading. Buy several. Use one now. Use one later. Whatever. Take advantage of it because I am taking it down pretty soon. I've already got an overwhelming response to it. I am um, elated with that response and, and I'm happy that it, it's going to help a lot of people. Um, but uh, take advantage of it now because, yeah. Anyhow, uh, all information, all information, all information on how to reach me is below in the description box. You can now go to my website and pay look around you can get life coaching um, you can uh, request a reading pay for the reading there you can do everything there you don't have to email me you can I will just direct you to the web address but that's okay um, 
what else is there? Follow me on Instago. Ask a question or two there. Follow me on Instagram. My handles are below. Thank you guys for tuning in once again. Um, remember Capricorn, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.